Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. I know I look crazy. I'm doing um this sheet mask that I got in my boxy charm for June. Um I don't really care for sheet masks. I like the ones that wash, you know, like facial wash, you know, the ones you wash your face with exfoliate. Um, but this one came with, it was like a six pack and a nice big box. It's, um, Grace and Stella. Um, it says it's like an energy, energy drink for your mask or for your face. I mean, um, face mask, anti-wrinkle and energizing face mask. Um, so, all right, that liquid in there is, I keep like spilling it and dripping it all over the place. But so it was a big box and, and it has like six of these. So I'm like, all right, well, I don't really like sheet masks, but I'll try it. So it says 15 to 20 minutes to leave it on your face after you, you know, have a clean wash face. So I left it on now for 20 minutes, but it's, it's, it just keeps falling off. Like I bent over and the whole mask fell off and put it back on. And it feels really cool and refreshing and nice. So, I mean, it's just a fact of, you know, it, it keeps not staying in place. It ripped here. I had to fix that. Um, it ripped here. Um, it's just, that's why I hate sheet masks. But anyways, let's take it off. <laughs> you see how easy? Now I don't look crazy anymore. <laughs> now it's just my natural self at 4 a.m. Um, this is what I do at 4 a.m. when I'm bored. But anyway, so it says after you take it off that you don't have to wash your face or anything. I'm just feeling to see if it feels like any sticky residue, but maybe a little tacky. Um, I don't know. I mean, my, I guess my face has got a little glow to it. Yeah, definitely. I see that. But other than that, um, as far as re reviewing their, the Grace and Stella, you know, face mask, it comes in a beautiful packaging and everything, but it just doesn't stay on. So, um, I do have like a nice glow. It says you don't have to wash it, but I mean, it does feel like kind of a little sticky residue, but, um, would I buy it? No. Would I recommend it? No. <laughs> definitely not but I wanted to just let you know what I thought about it and anybody else who got it this month um you know let me know what you what you think about it I don't like sheet masks I, I have so many I just I don't care for them they don't stay on I'd rather use face wash you know face scrubs and all that stuff um I like the charcoal peel off mask that's excellent um but anyways um I just wanted to also say because I'm about to go ahead and dye my hair in a second. But I wanted to go ahead and say, um, I did a video when I did, I went and got my Botox for my migraines. And I saw a different doctor, a different neurologist this time, and he was wonderful. I said to him, I asked him if I could record a while I was there, but um, he said he would have, they would have to get permission and stuff. So I was like, all right. Um, but, um, I recorded it like before he came to the room, but anyways, um, he, I never saw him before. He was a, a different neurologist. And so, um, you know, I asked him when he went to do, it's like 42 needle pricks every three months and I get it for my migraines. But, um, I asked him, usually I, I used to see the woman, she's wonderful, but I asked him when he went to do my forehead, um, I asked him to make sure like he really got those worry lines because I've had them for so many years since God, I've had them probably since my 20s because I am just, I am, and I worry constantly. I worry about everything. I worry about my kids. I worry about what's going to happen. I was just constantly, I go obsessed. But anyways, I worry. So he did, he did a lot extra on my forehead and told me, he even told me too, he's like, um, if one of your eyes become droopy, um, you know, it'll go back. I was like, what? <laughs> but thank God that didn't happen. So it says, it said you will see your full results in two weeks as far as Botox in the forehead, right? So, um, it's been working great for my migraines. But anyway, so at first I, I noticed a subtle difference, like right afterwards, just a subtle, but, um, I haven't really been paying attention and then um yesterday I happened to notice that like 
like right there in the center of my excuse my nails I have to redo them in the center of my forehead like it's I can't like I can't move this up and down like I usually can but he did an amazing job he really did he he really smoothed them out it hasn't even been the two uh full two weeks yet um but he did amazing um I'm going to get the Botox um in my lips just a, l a little bit so it's natural looking just a little bit and I'm gonna have the this is another doctor I'm gonna have him um just touch up a few little spots that I still see that need to be smoothed out and there's like a little line that I see but you probably couldn't but anyways it does look amazing compared to before I went for the Botox so it looks great just wanted to add that in so because I get it from my migraines but he did me the favor doing you know extra on my forehead which is wonderful because the Botox is like two to four hundred in your forehead um that's I got quotes from two different um places here where I live the one I'm gonna go to for my lips I could walk to it's like five minutes down the street so isn't that nice <laughs> but anyway so I'm gonna get a little something something done to my lips I don't, I don't care I'm I'm definitely pro um plastic surgery if you if it makes you you feel better and lifts your self-esteem go for it if you know what I'm saying go for it um everybody has things that they don't like about themselves they, they wish they could change I'm sure but I'm going to go ahead. All right. I hope you liked my video. Just wanted to do a quick review on the Grace and Stella She uh, Mask. Um, they came in the Boxy Charm for June. Um, I tried it out. I gave my review. It does have a nice glow now, my skin. But other than that, I wouldn't buy it. I definitely wouldn't buy it. I get, I, it's, it's not great at all. But anyways, I'll be, give my video a like and subscribe if you haven't before. And if you haven't been to my channel before, I'm so, uh, again, my name is Jennifer Lee. Um, and if uh, leave it in the comments if you have any questions or anything, you just want to say hello, whatever. Um, I'm going to go ahead and start dyeing my hair now because um, it needs to be touched up. But anyways, um, thank you for watching and then we'll see you soon. All right, bye guys.